Hey guys, this is your friend Mainak from Civil Center and I welcome all of you back to our channel and another video on AutoCAD. So friends, in today's video we will show you how to select a particular text in AutoCAD. So friends, we suppose we have a drawing here and we have and multiple values. So suppose we want to select everything which has marked PV4 in it. So how can we do that? So we will watch this in today's video. So in AutoCAD we have an option of quick select. So if you go to the home option and here in the utilities you have some option of your this is the quick calculator and this is the select all and uh, this is the quick select. So, so suppose I want to select all the uh, particular columns of mark uh, C1 here or suppose we have the particular uh, pb1 or b1 anything we want to select let's go for b1 so if you select the one to select b1 and b1 is written elsewhere also suppose it is written here it is written here or anywhere in the drawing you can just turn off the ortho and and suppose it's many in many places we have written b1 but we want to search for b1 only in this particular area how many b1 are there we want to know that and we want to select that so how can you do that so in this case we can use the option of your quick select and after we quick select and then apply to in the apply to you can select this option select objects we can select the area in which we want to find out the number of p1s so after that you can press space or enter and after that object type we want as text so this this one will be uh, your we have color line type plot transparency so we'll we'll go for your m text here object type and then we'll go for your we have the, we have uh, various options here operator equals we have various options uh, we'll go for the contents because we want to insert the contents so in the contents we'll just uh, do as your b1 We'll type capital B small one and then we'll click on OK so after you uh, can check that all the B1 which is in this particular area have been selected and the B1 which are not inside the selected area have not been selected so now use this command is very useful where we can uh, suppose we want to delete this or we want to edit this uh, particularly we can do it easily using this particular command so friends I hope that you found this tip in AutoCAD useful for more such videos stay tuned to our channel bye bye